Hello everyone and welcome to the latest modding tutorial for Into the Flames. So it all starts on the main menu. You'll see a little button that says MP skins disabled. You're going to click that <clears throat> and this will toggle the skins. So if you join a game with this disabled you will not see any custom skins whatsoever. So if you want to keep everything original nothing changes. If you click this enabled whenever you join a game you'll be able to see whatever other skins players have uploaded just like you. So there's a little disclaimer. Basically, we're not responsible for any custom images. Um, if anyone uploads vulgar images, we will be putting a reporting system in place to perma ban them from playing Into the Flames. And it will put a Steam ban on your account. Steam game ban. Um, so with that enabled, anyway, um, we'll just go ahead and load up the Academy for demonstration purposes. So we're going to pretend that this is a multiplayer lobby now, um, as everything works the same anyway. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to spawn whatever truck I want. We'll go ahead with the original tower ladder. So when we get in this now. Get I, which brings up the vehicle customization. You'll see we got this new skin customization tab. Now, if you have skins disabled on the main menu, this will not even show up. So, on our Discord, or anywhere you find it, um, you go to anywhere on here, you can see that we have a bunch of skins already. So, I kind of hand-selected this one. This is the Can't Land Volunteer Pack that somebody made. So basically, I would click on this, hit open in browser, right click, and copy image link. That's all you need to do. We can go ahead and hop back in. We'll control V that, load custom truck skin. That simple. And now everybody in your lobby can see that. Now, it's the same thing for a ladder board skin. As you can see, that one's right here. So we want to open that in browser, copy image link. Go back into the game, hit I, copy and paste that, load custom ladder board. And there we go. We have a fully decked out modded truck. Like I said, this replicates. Um, something cool is that when other players get in the game, it'll instantly show up. Now, some things I will say is you can no longer load a local skin if there is a modded skin in place. This prevents other players from getting into other people's trucks. Um, if you despawn the truck and respawn it, it'll be completely blank. Again, to default skins. Eventually, I'm going to add a save feature that'll uh, go into effect with the current truck save. So it'll save whatever skins you have on the truck. Um, but this is it. Nobody needs to download anything else or send things to your friends. Like, as soon as they join, this is it. Um, any questions, comments, you can go ahead and leave them below. Please hold suggestions to the Discord or the dev blog that'll be coming out later tonight. As of now, this feature is only available on the 1019 version and above. So at the time of this video, it's only for the Patreon branch, but it will be out to the public in a couple days. Thank you for watching.